Oh, let, let, let's, let's just stand in the middle of the thing. Middle of the road? Yeah, why not? Right. Let's see, the cops are busy. That way we can attract as much attention from people as possible. <laughs> Too close to the car, dude. Look at that. She's almost clipped you. Ah, well. We're standing in the middle of the road because we thought it'd be a cool shot. <laughs> How's it going everybody? I haven't done a proper outside vlog in a very long time. We're gonna go to Kettle Coffee Roastery here in Escondido. I've already talked about this. Clark, by the way. Hi, how's it going, Clark? How are you? Hey, doing? I'm good. How are you? Excellent. Yeah. Clark made a video yesterday uh, where we were reviewing the Kenya and he said a lot of bad things about it. Yeah, it's it uh, real harsh. Yeah. It's uh, I'll, I'll link it. You guys should check it out because I'm in it. He is in it. Um, Not to mention I give away a bag. Oh of yeah, the you did. Yeah, in that yeah. video. Yeah, yeah. So Who won? if you haven't seen it yet, uh, Joshua Eddie. Joshua, Joshua Eddie. Eddie. So if that's you, to make sure to cash in your free uh, coffee. Yes. Um, we're gonna go to Kettle. Kettle Coffee is here in Escondido. It's like a mile and a half from my shop. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, they are under new ownership. So I liked their coffee before. I didn't think it was anything to rave about. You know, I thought it was pretty decent, but you know, it was, it was good. It was good. Um, but Escondido doesn't really have a whole lot of coffee shops. So, they are the uh, only specialty coffee shop. So if anybody has some capital in the Escondido area, you should compete and open a coffee shop here because there's only one decent one. Um, but we're we're gonna we're gonna go down there and see if they changed anything up. If their coffee changed, maybe with the new owner. I haven't been since. Well, I have, but it was right after they bought it, so they hadn't had time. It's been a few months. I'm gonna, we're gonna go see if they changed anything. If there's any decent coffee, we're gonna try the coffee. Uh, let's go. It looks cool. They painted their uh, exhaust white, which looks awesome, and we should totally do that in our place. Yeah, I know. Thank you, Clark, for doing that. You see, look, now you can see what I'm talking about instead of looking at the building across the street. Pretty cool, huh? Ready to go. So that's the roaster, and it's right next door to the place here. Let's go inside. Here we go, man. Look at that. Bang. Dark side of the man with a Chemex. Uh, I ordered a really interesting bean. You know what? They are doing things differently with the new ownership. We actually talked, I think he's a manager. Is he? Yes, I asked him before. Wow. I talked to the manager and he said uh, that they're, they're they're kind of more experimental. They're move, They're trying to try out like new types of coffees. Did I understand him correctly? Yeah, I mean, yeah, sort that's of. What he said. Uh, we didn't get to talk to the roaster. I think that's who's like really doing, make, making most of the choices. And stuff. Yeah, but as a, an as a with well, the roaster. Ooh, yes. what, I, what I found on the counter was uh, this Honduras. Basically, it's a rare experimental micro lot fermented with orange peel which is something that would intrigue me if I saw it green from our from our uh, supplier um, and so I decided to order it and uh, cool down a little bit I've already tasted it a couple of times kind of I don't have patience so uh, let me let me try again he's like drinking half the cup and I'm like are we gonna film this or I don't know <laughs> let Dude, me try it while you talk this it. is so good um, Definitely get, getting that fruity end of it, but it's, uh, yeah, isn't that weird? But it's really good. Interesting. Yeah. This is what I came here for, okay? I, I was hoping they did something different, and they did. This is like yes. almost too sweet for me. Oh, like it's really suck it, dude. Mm. It's really sweet. I didn't put anything in it, so that means that the bean itself is so good. No, I know, and it's in the aftertaste too, which I think is interesting, because a lot of coffee, I feel like, when you try it, your initial impression is that it's pretty sweet, and then like the aftertaste gives you like a little like, eh. Um, but this one, it kind of tastes like regular coffee when you sip it, and then the aftertaste is like this really interesting That's actually candy, what he told me earlier. Type thing. Yeah, he said it comes in after. Uh, they put the greens, as I understand it, after they wash the coffee, the green coffee, they they mix it in with orange peel and they let it sit there for a little bit. And then they wash it and, and we roast it. But I feel like that's almost like cheating. <laughs> yeah, but who cares? <laughs> so this this has very powerful in taste. I feel like it comes in, in the back of the mouth for me. It's really like a very candied 
flavor. Yeah, it's very, like it's if, very like sweet. There's you bought like a little gummy orange thing and tasted it that, so that's what it tastes. There's no bitterness to this coffee whatsoever. At all. None whatsoever. Which if I think is really funny because I just got done telling him that pouring on V60 is probably going to make his stuff too bitter. Bitter, but he made that on a V60. And yeah. Yeah, you just criticized the guy as he was making the coffee. I, oh, this is going to taste <laughs> terrible. Not, though you're making it. No, and I did not say that. I just try to convince all coffee shops to move to Kalita. Much respect to Kettle for going this route. This is uh, this worked out for them. It was really good. Mm. Let's leave some for Max. Let's go back to the shop. Max, poor guy, he's out there trying to make a video. Let's You're gonna some bring him a bunch of cold coffee? Max, are you making a video Ready? today? No, I'm not. <laughs> I failed miserably. You, you, att you attempted though. I we did attempt, well, okay. Microphone it wasn't... stuff here. Yeah, check this out. It wasn't a complete failure. What it was is it revealed how unprepared I am for this oh, whole thing. It's a and, process. Uh, yeah, I basically kept forgetting stuff. I, I kept forgetting everything. Max is making a shot because uh, he's just because espresso. Because espresso, that's why. Yeah, you you, that's the only. What do you think you about eat. my crema? <laughs> Yummy! But look at that crema, dude. What do you think? <laughs> smell it, man. Smell it. Very good. Oh, smells like good crema, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Makes me happy. Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, so I forgot the coffee for Max to try. Clark over here. Clark, that's your ass. Jeez. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. <laughs> I think you have to go. <laughs> what do you got there in your hand, man? Where'd you get that from? Ooh, this right here, Clark just had. Uh, sorry, hold. We cannot show that bag. Some secret batch. Some secret government level coffee that's that we're not supposed to talk about. But I smelled the beans. Holy cow, dude! Sorry to Say make stuff? your vlog harder it here, but so I don't care. <laughs> yeah. What are you saying? This I'm not allowed to show any of this. No, you just don't say <laughs> and and I think we're fine. I'll just bleep what you just said. <laughs> it's a beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Is this how, how annoying it is to film? <laughs> Every shot has to be perfect, so you have to redo have to it and about, kill the flow. You have to think about all this stuff. Oh, dude, I made him redo so much yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> he, was, he like said something, and I'm like, no, that's great, dude. You gotta say it again. Clark, um, you're telling me it actually can taste better? Yeah. That's amazing, man. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so this, this coffee, in my personal opinion, in my personal humble opinion, is like 40 times better than Kenya. Hey, bro. Whoa. I don't know about 40, okay? What? Really? I don't know about 40, man. Four. 40 is a little Four. excessive. <laughs> I'd say it's a little excessive. Absolutely freaking This is incredible. the kind of coffee I really enjoy because it's not just like sour. It's not just acidity. It's like super good it just juicy tastes like berries. stuff that it's not really your normal it's type. It's just berries, man. Like a lot of these coffees, they have these lemon uh, citrusy taste notes. This is not citrusy at all. And it's super good. It's just berries, that's all it is. It's not even coffee. This isn't coffee. This is a, a red cherry from the coffee tree and they just mushed it up and uh, just made some juice out of it. That's what that tastes like. Mm. That's very good. Man. You could just freeze these and make popsicles out of them. And you can just eat them and they'll be amazing. They'll be fruity popsicles. This is the worst this frame shot ever. Yeah, you guys want to see good frame shots. <laughs> Check out my channel. <laughs> that's good, man. That's really good. Hey, that's the truth. Clark Surrey on YouTube. I'll post the link in the description, even though he's kind of an ass. <laughs> hey, Clark, thanks a lot for coming. Uh, and just, I didn't want to talk into the camera by myself for some reason today. So I just. That's like, how I'm helping. I just show up to make him feel more confident about vlogging. You made a great video yesterday. 
uh, uh, re reviewing the Kenya and a giveaway and stuff like that. Check out Clark Suri's vlog. I'm gonna put it the some or something it's somewhere in the description or something. <laughs> I'm gonna link it somehow. I don't know. Perfect. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah, we have a, we have a Facebook page. None of you know about it because there's like three people. <laughs> Cause I'm really bad at this stuff. But Vibrant Beans has a Facebook page. We're gonna be on uh, Facebook. I'm gonna be going live a few times on Facebook showing how Max does roasting and stuff like that. Uh, it's not gonna be on YouTube or Instagram. This is just gonna be for Facebook. We're gonna be doing some live videos. So uh, yeah, go like us on Facebook. I'm gonna put a link in the description to our Facebook, Vibrant Beans Facebook account. And check us out on Instagram. We got some cool stuff on there too as well, man. We're, we're all over the place and it's different. You know, this is vlogs. We got some stuff on Instagram. Check us out, Instagram, Facebook. We're gonna have all that in the description. Uh, what do you got to say for yourself, Clark? Uh, I don't know, just follow me on YouTube. I just like YouTube. YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you very much for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time around somewhere on one of those platforms, Instagram, Facebook, all over the place. Yes. Uh, I like attention, so I'm all, you know. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you for tuning in, and so long. Peace.